How are you now? Good. And you? Not so bad. Um, do you know where the washroom is? Sure. Just right back there. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. And I'm Jessica. Wayne. I know. It's Ahab's antagonistic qualities that causes his death, a bit like a, a Shakespearean but tragedy. But ultimately, it's Moby Dick that kills him. What you're suggesting is that the whale is actually malicious, that the whale intends to kill. Yes! That's the very reason why Ahab is so intent on destroying it. But what he doesn't realize is that he's going to lose in any confrontation with the whale. Why? Because he fails to recognize the superior being. I've been thinking about it for a while. And as misguided as the attempt was, and as childish as it was, and as lame as it was, okay, I... I get it. <laughs> At the end of the day, you were just trying something that you thought I'd want. And I can't fault you too badly for that. Everybody knows that vampires can't come into your apartment unless they're invited in. I don't know if that's wishful thinking or if you just like inviting strange men up. Maybe a little bit from column A and maybe a little bit from column B. What about you? Are you susceptible to an invitation? Do you want to come upstairs and watch another flick? You're serious about vampires. What can I say? Love at first bite. <sighs> Getting comfortable. What do you want me to do? She's loyal. The flow's heavy. And it's clean. <laughs> 